live life a little dangerously. Never start with diffidence, always start with confidence. When you work, work as if everything depends on you. When you pray, pray as if everything depends on God. We have to find the intermediate ways and means of restoring a degree of stability to our politics and more than a degree of safety to our citizens. Quality is first engineered, only then it is inspected. Nothing worthwhile is ever achieved without deep thought and hard work. No success or achievement in material terms is worthwhile unless it serves the needs or interests of the country and its people and is achieved by fair and honest means. Uncommon thinkers reuse what common thinkers refuse. Most of our troubles are due to poor implementation wrong priorities and unattainable targets. Money is like manure. It stinks when you pile it, it grows when you spread it. Making steel may be compared to making a chapati. To make a good chapati, even a golden pin will not work unless the dough is good. If I were to attribute any single reason to such success as I have achieved, I would say that success would not have been possible without a sustained belief that what I did, or attempted to do, would serve the needs and interests of our country and our people, and that I was a trustee of such interests. If I have any merit, it is getting along with individuals, according to their ways and characteristics. At times it involves suppressing yourself. It is painful, but necessary. To be a leader you have got to lead human beings with affection. I never had any interest in making money. None of my decisions were influenced by whether it would bring me money or wealth. I do not want India to be an economic superpower. I want India to be a happy country. Future belongs to the young. We must not only trust them with responsibility, but must thrust it upon them, whilst they are still young and full of energy, zest, hope and even illusions. However heartbreaking it may be to ourselves, we must make way for the new generations, even when we feel we are still in our prime. Good human relations not only bring great personal rewards, but are essential to the success of any enterprise. Common people have an appetite for food. Uncommon people have an appetite for service. Cleanliness is the hallmark of perfect standards, and the best quality inspector is the conscience. Always aim at perfection for only then will you achieve excellence. To lead men, you have to lead them with affection. I know that aiming at perfection has its drawbacks. It makes you go into details that you can avoid, but that is the only way you can achieve excellence. So, in that case, being finicky is essential. 
productivity and efficiency can be achieved only step by step with sustained hard work, relentless attention to details and insistence on the highest standards of quality and performance. Growing organizations in any field must constantly evolve, accept or even seek new ideas, new visions, and new enthusiasms.